Good morning, people. Happy Friday. So I am three days away from my birthday. So great reason to celebrate, right? I celebrate every day of my birthday month. So you guys know you've heard it before from me. And I wanted to share with you guys. I'm like talking and looking over here in my purse. Forgive me, forgive me, forgive me. Okay, so I have on my lips today again. Like I have to talk about this, y'all, because right now the girl is loving it. It's the Smashbox liquid lipstick and it's the color out loud today I decided to put it on with the Laura Mercier's uh, warm poppy lip liner so these two see how they kind of go like that's kind of so give it a little bit more of an orangey tint versus the brownie tint that I had on yesterday but I love the feel of this lipstick I love that it it just how do I put it it feels smooth it doesn't feel crepey or anything so I'm really really liking it I think these might be a go guys I I tried I wore it yesterday and then I went out last night and wore it last night and I was very impressed because the girl had hot wings okay ate hot wings and the, it stayed on it stayed on I was like yeah <laughs> I was so excited so okay let, look at the eyes people look at the eyes can you see anything I don't know what can you see so I'm on this thing for whatever reason I want to try foundations under my eyes you know you hear things on YouTube you feel like you just got to try them because everybody else is doing it it's been going on forever but I guess I'm just getting on the bandwagon as they say so today I have underneath my eye the Clinique beyond perfecting beyond perfecting foundation I think my color is caramel if I remember correctly on that foundation I'll double check but I think it's caramel and so what I did is I have my Marc Jacobs all over my face and then after I did my eyeshadow um, I ended up putting that on my eyes and then I just kind of set it with the the bomb uh, setting powder so that's basically what I got going on and I kind of like it I kind of like it yep 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 now on these eyes they're looking a little bit deep today I wanted to go a little bit dramatic I don't know I felt with this outfit that I have on I have on my big old gray pants that I just love so much and then I have on a, a cloth and what is it cloth and something <laughs> I can never think of this brand. It's something cloth and something. I want to say, I don't know, whatever it is that I got from Marshalls. I love this shirt and I was worried how it was going to look with these pants. Looks really, really good. These pants are my risque pants. Absolutely love them though. But anyway, getting back to these eyes because girl just jumped from the eyes to the pants to the shirt to, you know me. So on my eyes, I have on my Urban Decay number three, I think it is. The one that has all the grays and the um, what is it? Um, why can't I think this morning? Rose gold. All the grays in the rose gold. So that's kind of like what I've got going on on the eyes. That whole palette is on my eyes. I did use the darkest gray out of my Vizart palette to just kind of deepen my crease a little bit. So I don't know how well you can see that. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Got my foundation today set with my um, Ambient Trio thingy from Hourglass pretty much yeah that's pretty much it this is my ginger from Mac you know girl love it love it love it earrings my big old westerny looking earrings and then I got my little cubic zirconia studs on that are sterling silver that I got from TJ Maxx a while back freaking love 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 them so that's me in a nutshell today hair is looking kind of cute today y'all um, I did put um, like a cream on it last night one of my ones that I have I don't know um, I've been not putting gel, but I did put a little bit of cream on my hair last night because I wanted a little bit more moisture. I felt like I wasn't getting enough moisture. Like I felt a little dry, I guess. So I did put that on my hair last night. My nails is Pacific Blue. Okay, so this is the new Pacific Blue because, you know, the old Pacific Blue kind of changed out a little bit. And so this is the newer one. I still like it. I hadn't worn it in a long time. And I put it on the other day, so I've had it on for a couple days, but I don't think I've ever said anything to y'all as to what I was wearing. So just kind of letting you know right now what it is. So you guys have a fantastic Friday. By the time you see this, it might be Saturday, because I'll probably be vlogging like all throughout the day, um, and then like have one upload tonight, probably, because that's how I roll. <laughs> Loving, still loving this purse, y'all. It's really coming out to be a pretty decent purse. Oh, you know, I went out last night, had a great time. I ran into an old friend of mine, hadn't seen him in a long time. He still have all the drama he's always had. He's always looking for a good woman and can't find one. <laughs> he's always got me on the quest to find him a good woman, but, I, you know, 
it is what it is people it is what it is but I was I was out celebrating another friend's birthday at bar 8811 on Fredericksburg Road freaking love that place like I mean it's it's fun um, I enjoyed the band that was there last night and for the life of me right now I cannot think of Planet Soul was the band I was gonna say I can't think of it and then it popped in my head Planet Soul love 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 them they did a great job as usual last night place was a little crowded it's kind of a small place sound systems not the greatest so you kind of have to <sighs> whoa what do I say you just kind of have to go with the flow with the sound system but it is a fun happy bar it seems like it's a lot of the same old same old's and everyone's having a good time really fun place to go so I'm at work now and I'm looking around I don't see my other one of my other employees I know one of them's on vacation it's gonna be a rough day at work today y'all so wish me some luck hopefully I can make it through the day but you guys when you see this video know that I love you and I will talk to you real soon I'm saying like I'm not even gonna come back but you know me I probably will be back before the day's out I think I might go pick up my Sephora birthday thing today because I'm feeling a little birthday ish I'm like three days away guys I'm gonna count down oh my god 51 doesn't that sound scary it does but you know what I'm a trooper I'm gonna take it with a grain of salt because every year older that I get I'm blessed and even every year I get even more blessed because every year is more of a blessing you feel me so anyway I am going to go in here pretend like I'm happy to be at work pretend like this is the best place in the world because I can do that and I can do that well chat with you in a few alrighty so I uh, went to Sephora and I got my birthday gift I ended up getting the um, which I mean you know everybody knows what it looks like but I guess it's I ended up getting the Marc Jacobs. Okay, I'm sorry, guys. I'm like all looking behind me and everywhere. Um, I ended up getting the Marc Jacobs little lipstick and eyeliner thingy. I think it's eyeliner, right? Yeah, eyeliner. So I'm excited about seeing how that works. I haven't tried the eyeliner. I love the mascara. It does flake. It does get all over the place, but it's still a good mascara. So I'm actually kind of getting on the downside of mascara, so I'm going to have to pick out another one here shortly. I think I want to try the Chanel something or another. I don't know. but um, So that's what I got for my birthday, obviously. And then I went on and finally picked up. Let me see if I can't find it in my little bag over here. I have been wanting this Laura Mercier's translucent setting powder forever and a day. So I finally got it. I got the little tiny one that has a little puffer thing inside which is kind of good because I think I can use this in my purse as well like I can just kind of have it with me um, not that I ever like I am not one to like do stuff to my face throughout the day I really don't I mean I'll do my lips but I've been loving all these liquid lipsticks because I don't have to do my lips I don't know if this has like a little it doesn't uh, I wish it had like the little stopper thing in there but anyway this should go a long way that's what everyone says anyhow so I'm thinking that it will looking forward to giving it a try I've been wanting this forever in a day if I like it I will graduate up to the larger size but I just really thought you know I rather than to spend the money on the larger one and then may or may not like it I'll get the smaller one and then I will always have this one to like if I like it and I get the bigger one then I can always add to the little one to keep it in my purse or make it travel friendly when I'm going out of town and stuff like that so that was the purpose of this one so excited 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 and then I picked up some samples I picked up the Laura Mercier um, hello not the Laura Mercier I picked up the actual Urban Decay all-nighter sample which you know I I put it on my face yesterday at um, Ulta and today I picked up the sample so from Sephora which I don't know if I have let's see I got the oh they put a perfume I was like what is this that's a perfume sample they gave me I got the Becca backlight filter primer something another and then I got the Urban Decay, and then I got the Hourglass. The Hourglass I got in Golden Amber, and the Urban Decay is 8.75. So I actually got samples. So this weekend, y'all, girl, will be sampling and having fun and playing around with those. Cannot wait. 
Uh, alrighty, okay, making a mess here. So, stuck everything I'm back in my little bag and I am gonna go into work now and get the rest of this work day done. This was awfully loud. I hope it didn't interfere with my talking. Hey people, I am trying to make it home. I'm actually, I had to run by my credit union and then I had to, now I'm headed actually to get my car wash. One of my clients owns a car wash and in lieu of my birthday, he's giving me a free car wash. <laughs> really not really for my birthday, he's actually just giving me a free car wash because we were chatting today when he was at my office and we vibe like that and he was like, hey, you know what? So if I can get your car washed today on me, and I was like, okay, you know, a girl don't ever pass up anything for free. So, hi everybody, it's me, and I'm getting my car washed. My car is like so filthy. I'm actually at a customer's car wash, and I'm like, it's almost kind of crazy because these things are like, like I get real like scared about certain things, like they freak me out, and like, oh my god, I feel like. about what's going on to so you guys <laughs> I do I like totally freak out like I'm freaking out right now way down inside but I'm pretending like I got it all together but yeah these like seeing like ropes and things I don't know I'm like weird I'm that girl that will not go into like a boiler room or like I don't like things that like have pipes and weird high ceilings and noise I'm just weird like that but J Max and the forum now. I'm trying to make my way on <clears throat> to the Casa. I just can't I can't stay out of the stores. I have to. It's like therapy for me. It's been a it's like going to happy hour. <laughs> you know, it's like walk in there and see what you see and get the AC going here. I was gonna go into um But it's tax-free weekend, isn't it? Yeah. I forget about that. Like, I try to stay away from the source. So tomorrow, I got to go to Ulta. Because I need to return something at Ulta. And I'm going to stay out of, like, places like Ross. And I won't be... I might go into the T 
TJ Maxx new brothels because I'm gonna be at Ulta, but oof, it just depends on what the crowd looks like, people. This girl can't do all that. My nerves don't allow it. Just don't allow it. up me some popcorn at Target. Got two bags of it. I'm back on that popcorn kick. Mm -mm. I just don't know. We're going to hit some Blair, so we're going to mosey dopey on off of this. Mm, 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 mm. Hello, everybody. It's Sheila, and I just made it home. So, apart my weird angle right here, because I wanted to do, I'm like this because I wanted to do an outfit of the day video. Ooh. <laughs> Girl, got a little cleavage showing right now. Come on now. But anyway, I wanted to do an outfit of the day video, and um, I want to show you all these pants that I just absolutely freaking love, okay? So, bear with me. I'm going to back up and show you this outfit. The top I mentioned is, um, it's called Cloth and Stone. I had the hardest time remembering this, but it was like a top from Marshalls. Uh, they've had it a couple times since I've, um, I purchased mine. They even have, I've even seen it in TJ Maxx. Price point's like $29.99. So, you know, it's not that bad, but it's, you know, it's pricey for TJ Maxx, but very inexpensive for the brand that it is. So it's called Cloth and Stone, and like I said, it's got a little bit of a lower back and a higher front. This is a size large, so um, I pretty much, a lot of times do wear size larges. I don't like my things like super tight, but this isn't really a big large, so I don't know if, I, I would probably say it runs a little bit on the small side. Because I mean, I don't have a whole lot of room and, and a lot of times larges would fit me a little bit bigger than this. So, just a little FYI. And these plates hell are those pants that I've been telling you guys about so much. See how they have like, this is just like a drawstring that I didn't do anything with today because my top was covered. Don't look at my belly. Don't look at my belly. But, I mean, this is an extra small. That's why when I tell you guys, like, these run so big, they do. But, like, look at the seat. Like, this is the seat. <laughs> I love it, though. Like, they remind me of the MC Hammer pants, like, almost, but not really. And then the leg, if I tiptoe, maybe you can see, it's, like, a wide leg. So, it almost looks like I'm wearing a long skirt at times. Um, but, of course, when I'm walking, you can kind of see that there are legs to this madness. I'm kind of walking so you can kind of see. Absolutely freaking love these pants. They, again, they were $19.99. I don't remember the brand name. Maybe I can look and put it in the video. But they do have pockets in the, on the side. They don't have anything on the back. So the back is just, again, just a plain back. And they are like a charcoal gray. Love, love. I got so many compliments at work today. Today's casual Friday at my job. So like several... Of my clients came in and they were just like you are freaking awesome like they you know I, I got my own style and they kind of like it and I kind of like it so it all works really really well so just wanted to kind of show you this outfit of the day and you know while I've got you you're at my you at my while I've got your attention maybe I can show you my purse a little bit better this is my moto Rebecca Minkoff moto black moto leather handbag it's got tassels and it did come with extra tassels. One, I think two extra tassels maybe, but you can tie them on the zipper. This does hold my iPhone 6S Plus in it. And one side I have got uh, my pick for my hair and I also have my reading glasses. So it's a really deep bag though I will say, and it is black on the inside, so it does become the black hole. But um, of course it's got the media pockets and all that good stuff on the inside. But again, like I said, it is a black hole. This isn't a, a, a what's in my purse video, so we won't even go there because a girl got some junk in her bag today. But it does have the little small strap as well as the longer strap that you can take out or let in. And I do have it at the fullest, um, at the longest length. So that's what this looks like when I wear it this way. I can wear it as a crossbody, which is my favorite way to wear it when I'm out and about and need my hands and my space and all that good stuff. 
or if I'm just jumping out of the car to run in the house, a lot of times I just toss it over my shoulder like this and I'm out the car or running in. If I'm doing something really quick, I can just do it like this. So nice, nice bag. I've enjoyed carrying it. I'm loving it so far. Like I said, I was going to try to wait and carry this in the fall, but <clears throat> excuse me. I think my allergies are getting to me. Um, I just wanted to carry it for some reason, so I'm loving it. And while I've got your attention also, this is my um, Marc Jacobs tote that I purchased, which is actually, I got it in the purse section. So theoretically, I think it's a purse because it does have like the media pockets and all that good stuff going on. But this is what I carry with me every day to work now. I really, really love it. Um, it is a wipe off, like, um, I don't know what you call this material, but it's, it is wipe off friendly <laughs> and it's got the two pockets on either side. And I usually have an extra pair of glasses, reading glasses in there. Cause you know, these days girls can't see at all without them. So it really freaks me out not to have them. I actually got it a little bit over stuff right now. This, is, oh, whoa, this has been my makeup bag that I've carried. Oh, the ice cream man's coming. We have an ice cream man now. You guys can't see me, can you? Ha ha. But we do have an ice cream man now. And he's somewhere because I can hear his bell ringing. But anyway, this is, a, again, this is not a what's in my bag video. So we're not going to go too deep into it. But this is just like, this is my mug that I take in the mornings to work. And it just says, what does it say? Create. I don't know if you can see that. Create. But I wanted to lighten the load a little bit so I could throw it on my shoulder and kind of show you what it looks like. But typically, this is me in, it, in itself on my way to work. When I get out of my car, I toss it over my shoulder. Holds a nice water bottle right here. And then, of course, like whatever junk I need to throw inside. I always have my makeup bag with me. Lately, that's been my number one thing is having that bag. Because I've had all these new lipsticks that I've been experimenting with. So, I have to have it. So, but that's it. I just wanted to share that with you. God, look at these pants, will y'all? Look at this. Love it, y'all. Girl, I'm not trying to be vain up in here, but I'm just saying this is a, this is me. This is, this is the outfit that I say, you know, you're either going to like it or you're going to hate it. And that's all right by me if you hate it. I don't care because girl loves it, okay? I'm sorry. I know I'm going on and on about this outfit, but I just love it, love it, love it. You know, I'm liking this, looking at this just like this. That's making me think, hmm, on a good trip. But I still would carry it as a tote bag because I, I can't just have a purse like this. Like, I have to have my other purse too so but I do love this and it, it's like a taupe like a deep taupe and and the inside is a it just says Mark Jacobs Mark Jacobs it's just like my purse actually that I have um yeah so these are how the handles are like a little knot and then they're kind of I guess sewn or whatever onto the bag so yeah I just had to show you guys my outfit of the day and I am going to go ahead and get off of here because it is late and I'm leaning down because I'm doing this on my cell phone y'all but you know how it goes it's all right it's good we all good isn't that what they say we all good y'all <laughs> so anyway I'm just act acting silly having a great time it's Friday I don't have to work tomorrow I'll probably stay up tonight watching me a good movie a good show I finished Nashville oh my god y'all I finished Nashville Freaked me out last night because I was like, why is my show coming on? And I had finished it. Love it. You guys have got to watch it. It's a lot of country music, so if you don't like country music, you may not like the show, but I love country music. Am I showing my stuff again? Um, I love country music, so I enjoyed everything about the show. The ending was very dramatic, so I'm waiting for season five, I guess, which I'm assuming it's still coming on TV. I'm not 100% sure because I had never watched that prior to seeing it on YouTube. Or no, not YouTube. Hello, on Hula. So anyway, still got my lipstick on. It's probably pretty much worn now. Um, loving it. Loving the formula. So far, so good. Looked at some of the other colors. I don't know what other color I would buy at this point, though. I'm kind of undecided. I don't, I'm at a crossroad. Anyway, you guys have a fantastic weekend. I will probably be talking to you over the weekend. I'm going to do some housework, do some laundry, stuff like that, you know, my typical, but I'm probably going to do a lot of chilling this weekend. So hopefully we can do a serious video. If I say it out loud, it won't happen. So let's not pretend like I didn't say anything. Forget the girl spoke. <laughs>